trying to take a nap, but I couldn't just let this word go. So if y'all like me, y'all know there are two things that I keep speaking on, right? And I did so very badly want it to be um, fully manifested before the end of the year, right? And even in me saying that, I'm not disappointed, right? Like, yeah, I wanted a fourth quarter miracle um, in those areas, you know, but we don't get to decide how and when God does things. And so I pray that y'all aren't disappointed if it was bigger things that you were hoping that would have happened by the end of the year. And my hand's kind of ashy. I was in there helping them. <laughs> but you may not have seen them come into full fruition in 2021 but in my prayer last night i thank god for the full restoration in 2022 and i knew when i said it i was like Ooh, wait you know and so i'm thankful for that okay and still um appreciating the process okay and trusting his time so meg where are you going with all this this is what i want to show you y'all y'all know for months now we have been looking at my parents grass i want you to look right here and i want you to look right here okay now god had gave us those words during that time and i told you my dad was talking to me and he'd be speaking prophetically i don't think you know it but he was talking to me about the grass and how it had to grow up so that it could start being maintained and cut and all that you know like we were following the word so all his grass was coming in beautifully y'all can tell like all the areas that's not that spot or that spot and all of a sudden they cut these giant Bradford pear trees that have been here since we moved here. So things that have been deeply rooted in this yard, things that have been growing up over the years. But in order for us to get to the full manifestation, right, the fullness of this new, healthy, lush grass, those trees had to be removed. And let me throw in here, I didn't know they was cutting down the trees. Like I just came over one day and the trees was gone. I was like, what? And so today when I got over here, look again okay i was in the house and my dad was like do you see those two large brown spots in my yard and i was like yeah like that's where they cut them trees and um he was like give it seven days and i was like seven days like he didn't say seven days at least 50 times <laughs> and he was like give it seven days in seven days it's not going to be any more brown in seven days all that should be green it's supposed to be green and if we were to look now you could see where the green is growing in on these brown spots now if i got closer y'all be able to see better but i'm not getting up sorry a little lazy but you can see where the green is covered in okay and so i just want to release that to all of us myself included okay it's so much to be thankful for even with those two brown spots from where they had to remove something okay and it had to be removed so that you could see the fullness of the health and the lushness of the new grass okay and i want to put emphasis on the fact that it was two trees okay it's so much to be thankful for in spite of those two brown spots where those trees were where things had to be removed they it look a little dead right now but you can see the life you can see the grass coming up all of the rest of the yard that is now filled with this beautiful grass it's so much to be thankful for don't get caught up on the two spots where it's not coming in yet you will see the fullness the full manifestation you will see it in its full fruition okay in 2022 now my daddy said in seven days um he said they just i don't know when he started his seven days because he just said give it until friday so maybe they put something in it yesterday i don't know but because today's saturday yeah but he said give it seven days this is obviously seeds or whatever that was planted in 2021 and i mean like yesterday was still 2021 and he said give it seven days that's now 2022 like this is actually jam-packed and when my dad was talking i was talking to my mom like i think it's a word like it had to be removed things that were growing up over the years it had to be removed so that we could see the fullness okay god is good say thank you because it's a whole lot of yard that now has this healthiness this lushness this like this grass looked like this in the winter time no shade at my mom and them neighbors but look at everybody else's grass y'all and make you wonder what they doing over here okay it's a it's a difference okay it's the type of seeds that was planted it results in a different harvest. And before I cry, let me get off of here, okay?